Hello, I am IceBeast, and welcome back to Distant Worlds Universe. For those of you wondering, I did, of course, save correctly. I am very happy. And now we are back, and we are once again recording Distant Worlds, getting ready for a new war. Um, the first thing we're going to want to do is upgrade the second fleet. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I need to confirm that my ships are, you know, in tip-top shape. So what I want to do is first edit this design. Um, just, you know, quickly look at it. That's what I'm doing right now. Okay, I'm going to cancel that. Now I'm going to auto-upgrade the design. It did, in fact, upgrade. Now let us check it out. I believed it reduced the armor by one. Um, I wish you could do a side-by-side -side comparison. It says advanced fighter base. Um, show latest designs. No. Show all designs, which is not what I want at all, but we want, yeah, let's sort by this. There we go, carrier. So this is the carrier we're currently using, I believe, which has more armor, as I thought, more fighters. So more armor, more fighters. Interesting. Wait, why are you using the Corvidian shields? Wait, is that the right shield? Is the Corvidian shields the right shields? I'm sorry, guys. Um, no, the Tassaron shield is the right shield. Okay, let's cancel that. Um, is there any other carrier we have that actually has ships of that class? So let's edit this design. 27 armor, Tassaron shield. Advanced Fighter Bay. I don't really know what upgrade design I just upgraded. I should be able to figure it out from uh Okay, whatever. I should be able to figure it out from here. This is the CX10 Mark II. Are there any other goddamn carrier designs that I that I'm missing? How did I have a CX12? Okay, interesting. Well, you have the Tassaron Shields, the Advanced Fighter Bay, 29 armors. Um, you have a heavy railgun, which I'm going to remove. Uh, so I think this is effectively the same basic design. Um, I will add a one unit of, of a armor. Are you using, wait, is enhanced armor better than standard armor? Oh, hell yeah, it is. You should be using enhanced armor. Yeah, 30 units of enhanced armor. Okay. Um, and I think I want to give you two units of shielding. Yeah, that gives you 1,200 shield with 160 recharge rate. It is absolutely ridiculous. Otherwise, we got 32 fighters. I think this is pretty good. Um, I think I want to give you fleet targeting system and fleet countermeasure system as well. I don't know if I need both of those, the regular and the fleet. Uh, the stealth cloak doesn't give me enough stealth rating to be useful. All right, this looks fine. Um, are you using the right engine? Proton thruster, vortex engine. Proton thruster, vortex engine. Why am I not using the Vortex engine? God damn it. Um, where the hell are you, Proton Thruster? Vortex engine. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, okay, we need to reduce you by one. That's not a problem. I think if I get rid of one enhanced armor, nope. Looks like we'll have to get rid of one vortex engine. That's fine. Could put that enhanced armor back on. Can I see like obsolete components? That'd be really nice because I have the thrust vector as well, uh, which does appear to be the correct thing. Let's sort by name. 
Vance Fighter Bay. Basic Proxa White Ray. Yes, yes, yes. What the hell's the damage control unit? Is there something better? Why don't I have damage control unit on here? That's odd. Energy collector is fine. Enhanced armor we know is correct. Equinox jump drive, the fleet systems, the hab modules, the life support, the quantum reactors, um, the taser on shields. Wait, why do I still have nine standard armor? That was weird. Um, thrust vectors, ultra dense fuel cells, vortex engine. Can I get another vortex engine now? Okay, I can. Now, do I have a better damage control unit? Once again, I'm doing incredibly exciting things. I apologize. Apparently, damage control units are not in existence right now. Damage control unit is under CST, construction yard. Oh, that's because the repair bot is better. That's what I'm looking for. The S2 uh, F4 repair bot. Where did I get that from? Damage absorption. Oh, that, this, interesting. Okay, yeah, so we do want the S2 F4 repair bot. All right, so you go away, you come in. All right, save that design, finally. God, that was frustrating. Um, and the problem is we're gonna have to do this uh, for everybody, basically. So the cruiser, we need to edit the new cruiser design. Um, did it use the new torpedoes? It did, that's at least good. Um, we have enough energy for everything that is good let us see what we got though vortex engine repair bot we don't want an advanced fighter bay on here um i sort by name i do not want an advanced fighter bay on here uh do we have the hyper deny we do we have the heavy rail guns so you have the fleet systems which means i don't really need them on my carriers but whatever they're small doesn't make a huge difference got the enhanced armor um Got the quantum reactors, got the vortex engines. This all looks good. 28, we got energy. I think I wanna give you some more Oberon torpedoes. So I need to have, okay. So we're gonna give you 15 Oberon torpedoes, which is still in the right bounds. Beautiful, and we're gonna just stick with the eight heavy rail guns. Actually, I'm going to drop you down to 13 and bring up a few more heavy rail guns. There we go. Because the heavy rail guns have penetration power, which is really nice. Um, and we'll get rid of that. Okay, cool. Done. Um, destroyer. Let's do the same thing. Let's edit the destroyer design. Um, I think I'm going to give you just slightly more shielding. Uh, let's give you two more shield units. We still have plenty of excess energy. Um, I think I'm gonna give you one more Oberon torpedo and one more heavy rail gun. And then we will add the hab module and the, um, where are you? Life support module, hab module, cool. And then we need the frigate to be upgraded as well. Um, automatically upgrade. The frigate's probably fine with the upgrade that it did. Yeah, this all looks fine. Um, I think I'll give you one more torpedo. But this is fine. These ships are supposed to be light anyway and fast, so we'll do that. Um, let's auto-upgrade you. Let's edit you, because you're going to have received uh, weapons almost. No, no weapons, but you did get assault pots. That's kind of cool. I kind of like that. Um, nice. Then we want to uh, auto upgrade these designs. I'm assuming everything here is just going to be fine. I'm not even going to really check everything. Uh, just making sure everything is 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 hunky dory. Uh, yeah, this looks fine. This all looks fine. All right, cool. So I think that's a pretty pretty good place to be. Let now what we're going to do is. Fourth fleet is here. Did you get to Kappa? You did. What I want you guys to do is first fleet. Retrofit to latest designs at nearest shipyard. That's what you're gonna do. 
And I want you guys to do actually do the same thing. This should give me a slight upgrade in, in weapon output. And firepower once everybody gets upgraded. Third fleet's still trying to refuel. The fourth fleet is in the right location. They just need to refuel now. And the fourth fleet will upgrade to the latest design once, once they're ready to go. Sweet. Get that sweet, sweet, re uh, um, sweet, sweet research taken care of on galactic trading. Three months. Off you go. Uh, and you, weren't you supposed to, oh, you're the one blowing stuff up. You finished your espionage missions against the Naraz as well. That's what happened. Uh, galactic trading. Three months. Off you go. Hell yeah. I'm pretty pleased with my, my spy efforts going on right now. Methodical. That seems pretty good. Wait, are you? Where the hell are you going? Did I click on somewhere out in the middle of nowhere by accident? First fleet. First fleet, you're supposed to be retrofitting. Retrofit to the latest design at nearest shipyards. Of course we'll exchange maps. Second fleet is is trying to retrofit as well. Let's look at the space station. I can see everybody who's docked. Um, oh, we've completed strike bombers. Hell yeah. I don't know how you actually decide what's in your carriers. Never quite figured that out. But I thought I queued it up to automatically start researching um, this stuff. Yeah, let's get down this line a little bit. Improvements to the massive railgun. Now, the funny part is that I learned is the massive railgun. I wonder if they fixed this in, in the mod. The massive railgun does significantly more damage with longer range. It's a little bit slower, a little bit more energy. All right, um, but its rate of fire is significantly slower. That was the problem that was going on here. As you see, the rate of fire on the massive railgun is 2.8 seconds, whereas the rate of fire here is 1.8 seconds, which means that... Uh, Basically, it's one second slower, so so this would be, what, 3.6 seconds, uh, whereas this would be 4.6 seconds, or no, 5.6 seconds. So it should be after, um, for every three shots this guy takes, two shots will be taken there, because this would be, what, 3.6, so the next one would be, uh, or this one would be, 3.6 so the next one would be at uh, um, 5.4 whereas this one is at 5.6 already so yeah uh, every three shots this one takes two shots that one takes and and it doesn't this one doesn't do uh, three three halves more damage or 50% more damage to really make up for that so you really need to go down this line until you get to about this one where you actually make up for the slower firing rate. Um, and then these other ones start really start making up for it. Once you get down to uh, super dense assault drivers, uh, you're doing great. Anyway, I didn't mean to give you guys a, you do a lot of math, it just sort of happened. Ah, wow, my brain hurts a little bit after doing all that. I want to check in on, on Caruso's here. Yeah, they're happy again. We're going to upgrade their, their, their thing up to 20% now. That should, they should still be pretty happy. In fact, we can probably go up to 30% here. Yep, and they're still happy. Fantastic. Uh, any pirate problems? Not at the moment. So the second fleet is getting bigger, as expected. Nice. We need to get more research on Galactic... Um, did I accidentally screw that up? No, I didn't. Just click. It just reset into a weird thing. All right, Naraz, Steel, Research, Galactic Trading, three months, off you go. Same for you. It's a weird research ca category, Galactic Trading. It's like, do you not know how to trade until now? I mean, I realize what it's trying to say is it's like, you're getting an advanced degree in Galactic Trading, but it just sounds like... You've been an idiot this entire time, and now you finally figured out how to, uh, to 
he finally figured out how to actually, you know, get, um, you know, get the most out of, of trades. Ah, uh, idiots. That's what, that's what they're implying you all are. Cool. So once the retrofit's done, and it hopefully will be done soon, this will get a nice upgrade, and then we'll get some new ships to, to fold into it. That's the next thing we want to do uh, now that we've upgraded all our designs and everything. Making good money. Uh, what are we... Who's researching what where? This is Harmonized Thrust. Okay. After Harmonized Thrust, I think... Oh, yeah, I do want to get Mega Scale Construction. I think I will... Uh, try to rush mega scale construction and we can rush projectile arrays that should be super cheap yeah let's do that crash research on projectile arrays i think is a good idea yep that that just basically happened and then we'll crash research this one super cheap again So yeah, we'll get these nice and quickly. What was... Did you see that, guys? That was weird. This had a red highlight around it. That was just odd. Um, cool. Yeah, not a whole lot to do right now. I mean, we're in the weird, like, rebuilding phase. And that... Wow, everybody finished. You succeeded. Cool. Now, that, that hopefully helps you with your sabotage a little bit. Can we... Um, destroy something what about like some random gas mining facility 81% to destroy a random gas mining facility let's do sabotaging some more stuff uh, let's try on Frydor they have a planet called Iran I think I noticed that before but Frydor spaceport is definitely the best place to go alright so go over there and sabotage some construction that's fine. Oh, and then I have those other guys that need to be getting me the stuff. Get me the good stuff, guys. I need that sticky icky from, uh, from these guys. Yeah, just keep getting me that good, good, good galactic trading. Are all my scientists in good places? It appears they are. If they're at a Surian station, you really should be at a research facility. I don't know what type of research facility Wretched Gate is, though, but... Oh, I totally forgot to send these guys on missions. Hee hee hee. Cancel. Steel research, Naraz, steel research, galactic trading. It'd be nice thing if there was like just repeat last mission. That'd be a nice uh, option here because you have to do this multiple times to effectively get what you want. You can't always get what you want. We try sometimes. Today, you get what you need. Wow, you went to twelve thousand firepower. That is a significant boost. Um, simply from from nothing, effectively. Ah, uh, the Actarians aren't too happy with us. You're happy with me. The Dagolins are really happy with me. Um, let's trade with them. I need to get more uh, mutual def uh, defense agreements. So that's something we're working on here. But the other thing I want to do now is start building some ships for the second fleet. I want to give them... Um... Oh, interesting. I don't have any frigates. I forgot that I basically had no frigates for any of my fleets. But yeah, we're going to get you like five frigates, 12 destroyers... 12 cruisers. They actually have a lot of carriers in the second fleet. But we will I will get you another So what's that? That's 24 29. We'll get you six carriers. We'll take you to 35 and combined we'll have 68 ships. Boom. And then once these guys finally get to uh, be fully fueled, we'll be in a position where god, you guys need just need to get fuel. Can you refuel at Caruso's itself? Yeah, Let's see if we can get you some fuel over here at least. 
think I want to build a small space facility here, but I don't know. It might not be required or necessary. But somebody escaped with shit of mine. Is that what that just said? Pretty sure. Success, success. Yeah, this is somebody else. Bastards. Um, so we need these two guys to go back out. And then we'll check real quickly on how close we are to actually getting this done. It won't be very close. This is the higher you get, the less useful um, trying to steal is. But it does give us research points. You know, you don't lose research points ever, which is not bad at all. Not bad at all, guys. This is about to finish right here. That's why I wanted to wait. I will crash research that as well. And then let's look to see where, what, where are we stealing? We're stealing um, galactic trading. So we've gotten it 15% done, 16% done already, which is not too bad, I don't think. Uh, you're almost done with advanced fleet countermeasures, which is cool as well. Anyway, this is going to be the end of the episode, so I thank you guys very much for watching. I know it's been a pair of relatively slow episodes, but we are going to strike against these guys. I mean, that is happening in the relatively near future. I did not want to open the Empire Policy screen. I wanted to open the Military Strength screen. Yeah, we're getting a nice little bump from upgrading our ships, and we'll get even more of a bump as we continue to upgrade our ships. But with that all being said, I thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you all next time.